Live from the Alamo City with your host, Bridget Smith. Featuring Eileen Tevis, Paul Morellis, Kim Spradlin, and Danielle Saar. This is Great Day SA, San Antonio's number one lifestyle show. Good morning. Once again, Chef Soto is here with us. Chef Mercedes Soto. That's it. I've been practicing that. Thank you. Thank you so much. Good to have you here. Well, thank you for having me over. Yes, you're yeah. from Purple Sage Ranch That's in Bandera, correct. Texas. That's correct. Just a short drive from here. Yes, yeah. just a little one. 30 minutes drive. Absolutely. Beautiful hill country view. Wow. Okay, awesome. so what are you making for us today? Well, today I'm planning to share with you a great recipe that I grew up with. Mm -hmm. What did my mother cook? Well, I was, I was a kid. And it's ready. Yes, no. yes it is. It, is. it sounds like it's ready. Well, you see, I'm going to show you. That's the uh, final process. Oh, oh bummer. We have to wait. <laughs> let me tell you, this recipe is one of the favorites of the uh, Purple Sage Ranch. Oh, cool. All the guys love it. And I love to share it because, like I said before, I learned it with my mother. Okay. Uh, that's so cool. And yes. since Mother's Day is coming, it's something that I would love to share with you for you to give to your mother. Very yeah. nice. That's very very nice. cool. Okay, and you, I know that you said you grew up cooking with your mom in the kitchen Correct. and a lot of your recipes that you use today at the Purple Sage Yeah, Ranch but I never thought me. that I was going to be cooking, oh. I'll tell you that. <laughs> yeah. I, was, I was a troublemaker. Yeah. I was the youngest. <laughs> I was the youngest of five kids, imagine. So I would get away with everything and anything. Oh, so very nice. So I would nice. do whatever I should have done and then I would run into the kitchen, sit down and pretend that I was watching my mother cook. You see those pots? It's yes. Like the pots that my mom used to use. Yeah, these oh, are wow. actual those are my old recipes. Pots. You see how old they look? Don't They're ask me how old I am, okay? Please don't, <laughs> don't That's know. That's awesome. Here. So do you use these at the restaurant? I do. This is your recipe I do. Books. Some of them, No yes. way. I do. How cool is And guess that? what I have for you, ladies? You have something for us. And should I go ahead and put these on right away? I don't know. Sure. Sure. Yes. No, I got it. I I I I'm going to assume I here. I need two sushi. Thank you. Oh, And yes. I'll take this because I'm wearing a white shirt. There you go. It would be just like me to get things I heard that you guys are really good in the kitchen. Oh, uh, yes! All right. Yes. We are. Awesome. Yes, thank you for asking. Well, <laughs> the first procedures that I have here, I'm going to show you. Okay. Is going to be, my plate is going to be tinga poblana, which is, uh, <gasps> what is that? it yeah. is a uh, pork, but a pork shoulder. Uh-huh. And that one you oh, simmer, right you simmer, that's correct. This you simmer is a real down. live pork shoulder. That's right. You nice. simmer down mm -hmm. with hot, hot water, of course. Sorry. Okay. A little bit nervous, guys. No, you're <laughs> That's doing okay. Great. You're doing great. Yes. Okay. Oh, wow. Okay, so that you is have boiling. water boiling. You have to have your water boiling. You have to put your pork shoulder uh -huh. in the water. Don't let it. Okay, and can fall. I ask you this? Is there a, a secret to picking the right like cut of meat? Because for whatever reason, every time I try to do something like this, it turns out like an old piece of wood. To be honest with you, you just have to be. Uh, right. Give it some love. Okay. Because you see the fat that he has? Yeah, the marbling uh -huh. is good. Yeah, that is perfect for you to the meat to be very tender. Okay, cool. And Sorry, the extra flavors. It. Curious okay, about that. Okay. And also depends on the uh, how long you leave it on cooking or simmering okay. or mm -hmm. boiling or depends if you're gonna. Okay, I'm gonna have it. you over to my house to show me this meat. Make please. sure you're free. <laughs> after I, I, you yeah, taste I'm starting my to see plates, it. After you taste my plates, you guys are gonna love it. <laughs> okay, cool. Okay, what's next here? Then we are gonna put some bay leaves. Bay leaves. Bay leaves. Correct. Okay. A little bit of go up. Um, Onions. Onions. Those onions, uh -huh. onions, and yes. then garlic. Yum. A little bit of all things I like. Yes. Pepper, Pumino. Okay. And pepper, and then we have oregano. Got it. A little bit of salt. And you added these. And you added these uh, spices. Why? Why? Because you're gonna let it simmer until it cooks all the She's way for about an hour or so. Oh. And you're going to let those flavors to marry, to get to know each other. You know how it is. Yes, yes. Let well, we're learning some, from you love. right now. <laughs> give some love there. So then you're going to let them cook. Uh -huh. And it will take about an hour, the most. Okay. Then, That's not very long. That is I'm one impressed. of the processes. Mm -hmm. okay. okay. Let me put this on the side because I have the So once this is finished. done, this is what this, this is going to look like. Done. Okay. Wow. Oh. It looks incredibly oh, so tender. Now, Get your hands did it there. fall apart by itself or did you have to shred it? By itself. No, oh, it just falls that's apart. when you know it's you know ready. It's yes. Okay, so this is just a part nice. of the recipe though. Exactly. Like, okay. It's part of our, the recipe. Okay. Right here in this pan, what I'm going to do, I'm going to put a little bit of um, chorizo. Mm. You know, everybody knows what is chorizo, right? We like sure. that sizzle. That sizzle is really good. It's some Mexican sausage. You're going to put it and you're going to um, let it to cook all the way. Break it, crumble. Now while you, you see do that, that yes, yes, we smell it. We smell it. We see. How it. can we not? When, yeah. While you do that, I want to ask you this question because you've got such an interesting story too, Chef. And that is, you came. You actually were born in the United States, and then you left for Mexico. Yes, uh -huh. I, in actuality, yes, I was born in the States, but I grew up in Mexico, mm -hmm. and I learned the language when I was very 
not old, but I'm, you know, You mature. are not old, stop saying that. Right. <laughs> right. <laughs> right, exactly. Well, this this smells great. absolutely yes. amazing. Yes. And very nice. Wonderful. You know, it was I, great. It was very great because it gave me the opportunity to kind of um, bury those, um, my, my worries, my... Yes. That's right. Mm -hmm. And here you are. Here you are. All the right, executive Mercedes, chef. Well, thank you for it. We're going to have to taste this later, Portina, because I know we're going to be with you later in the show, also making something a little sweeter. Oh. And also, you all stay with us because later in the show, we'll be giving away a two night stay to the Purple Sage Ranch. Oh, very nice. You got to stay with us for that. <laughs> Coming up, we're back in the kitchen with Chef Soto, and uh, we've got three words for you sweet potato pudding. Oh, yeah. We'll be right back. All right, so you're back to watching me take a bite of the tinga that we made earlier in the yeah. show. That's, that's correct. Mercedes. That's correct. And you forgot to put one of the best ingredients. Oh, my goodness. My green salsa Amazing. that we can in a purple sage ranch. That is so good. You can buy oh, it on the, the, on the website. Salsa. Yes, we Very have cool. the green, the red, and we also have the barbecue sauce. Perfect. And you can buy it on the uh, purple sage ranch. The perfect thing to top off a tinga. That's correct. All right, Mercedes. So now tell let us me show you. Eat, yeah, tinga. What do you need? Something sweet. Well, let me show you real quick because I know you know. It. And TV has to be fast. I learned that today. <laughs> so guys, You're doing great. we have sugar, cloves, vanilla, Yum. a little bit of salt, and cinnamon. You're gonna mix it up to everything together. Okay. With the eggs. Mix them very good, whisk it, put them on the, in the pan, grease, put them on the oven. Okay, so you're mixing with all these things correct. first. Correct, okay. with a sweet potato. With sweet potato, and is it one already hour, pureed? Or? Correct, you okay. have to puree it, and then you mix it all together, put it for one hour and 350 degrees, and this will be the final. Unbelievable, and you guys cannot know how good this smells right well, now. You're gonna try okay, it again. So is it my time? And let me tell you, I have a cucaracha for you. Ooh, what's you know, a cucaracha? a cucaracha is a La roach. Cucaracha. That's the, the one, cucaracha. exactly, and it's right here. I know what that is. Oh my God! It is a drink made with Kahlua in 1800. No way! Yes, okay, it is. and this has Kahlua and 1800 tequila, and you can sip it right. while you, you eat your this dessert. This is unbelievable, by the I way. I told just, you. The bite just hit me. Oh, I'm take glad to hear that. You go ahead, look. That's you can sip delicious. it on the cucaracha. It's kind of like pumpkin pie, but better. You know why they call it cucaracha, right? For two it's reasons. Means roach. Yes, you know, for two reasons. Because the color. Okay. And if you drink through more than three, you'll be like a little cucaracha on the side. No one's ever called me Little Roach before, Mercedes. But I'm not calling you. You know what? I like it. <laughs> we can be friends. Great. Okay, amazing. This is absolutely delicious together. I'm so glad and you so enjoyed it. And so if you guys want to find Mercedes, Purple Sage Ranch is where she's at in Bandera, correct? That's correct. And we are giving away a two-night stay at the Purple Sage Ranch. It's a weekend getaway, and we're giving it away right now. So if you want to win that, be the fifth caller. Give us a call, 946-GDSA, and go see Mercedes at the Purple Sage Ranch. We'll be happy to have you, guys. They will be happy to have you, and they won't That's call correct. you Little Roach. That's correct. <laughs> All right. Thank you for being here with us. This thank you so much for morning. having me. We want to say thank you so much for watching today. Coming up tomorrow, She's the mother of our city's mayor, that's right, and congressman. We're talking to Rosie Castro. She sits down exclusively with us. She's only telling Great Day SA Plus. All right, we're going to tell you how to grow your own veggies and eat them, too. Oh. We'll tell you how tomorrow. A little urban garden yep. and a deal you can't refuse. Win mom a weekend at the Cachada. Yeah. Yeah. Love Cachada. I heard that there's a big announcement from one of our audience members. Quickly, go ahead, tell us. Mom, Dad, if you're watching. I'm pregnant. What? Oh. And, you made, and your name is? Kara. Kara. Oh. Okay, mom and, and dad. Hey. Happy Mother's and, Day. And just for the record, that happened prior to the show.